Fast forward to altcoin season. You wake up. You wake up. You know, you go on about your day. Maybe going to getting ready to go to work. You get up. Uh, you know, I don't know how you guys do it, but first thing I always do, I check the market. So you guys, you know, you get up, you check the market. You see your coin going up. Oh, okay. When I went to bed, it wasn't going up like this. Hmm. See, I'm up a couple hundred dollars. You're going about your business. Check in a couple hours later. Hold on. Wait a minute. Do I even want to work anymore? <laughs> I quit. I want to get to know you guys. I really want to know you guys as far as what are you planning to do with your crypto earnings? In other words, why are you in crypto? Why are you in crypto? I want to make a difference. For me, I want to make a difference. I want to retire family um, and just enjoy life. Enjoy, you know, the rest of this life that uh, God has uh, blessed me with having. And I want to enjoy that. And I want to see smiles on loved ones' faces that uh, that don't really get the time, the freedom to in enjoy this beautiful thing that we call life. That's why I'm into crypto. I always wanted uh, some form of financial freedom. I wanted to find some vehicle that could get me to financial freedom. And crypto was the uh, vehicle of choice but of necessity and you know i talk to you guys all the time down in the comments and you know you know i'm like man i really want to get to know some of you guys because a lot of you are you know are returning constantly and you know you always got uh words of encouragement for myself and those in the um down in the uh, comments and i you know i love that I, you know i'm a positive person i'm always looking at the brighter side but i also i've been through a bull run so i know what it's like to look up and see uh almost six figures when you in cumulative when you look at it and this i'm talking about i'm referring to uh last bull run cumulative i was uh over six figures didn't take any of that by the way so yeah <laughs> but I know so many people that made money in the last bull run, but they are still currently in their same situation because they didn't have any plans for that money. So I wanted to do this video. I really, really wanted to do this video kind of to connect with you guys. And because uh, I'm really thankful of you guys always showing up to the videos, always giving encouraging words, always taking time out for those that's down in the comments that may not have the experience that a lot of you have. Or just those of you are just walking beacons of positivity. Positive, positive, positive. Up. So I said, I really want to get to know each of you. And um, if you want to give your names, that'd be perfect too. Comment below. But what I really want to hear from you guys is why are you in crypto? How long have you been in crypto? Why are you in crypto? And what do you want to accomplish with, with uh, crypto? Is this like just play money for you? Or are you really trying to uh, forge a, a different path in life? What are you trying to do? Because everybody has different goals. You know, some are well off, more well off than others. Uh, and some are just less fortunate than others. But I truly believe that when you when you line everything up, we're all no different when it comes to where we're trying to get in life. I'm, I'm willing to go out on a limb and say everybody that's um, in this particular group, in this uh, community, that this wonderful community that we have, I'm willing to go out on a limb and say that everybody wants better days. Everybody wants uh, financial freedom. Some of you may be uh, blessed enough to have it, but uh, everyone wants something a little bit different, but yet the same, if that makes sense. And I just, with this, this coming altcoin season and with how fast and how fast things can elevate i just want you guys to i want i want you to share with me and share with the other community members who you are a little bit about yourself what your background is and um what brings you to crypto
And, and um, what part of the world you're in? I know we've did that before. We've done that before where you are. Um, but yeah, I'd like to know where you are. I'm in South Dakota, believe it or not. Um, but I'm, I'm just interested in you guys. And it would help me to know a little bit more about you. So when I'm going forward with making videos. And I also ask that you guys uh, share these videos. If you know people that can use some positivity in their life. Or just can learn a little bit more about... Um, crypto don't keep this community a secret you know share it with them make sure you hit that bell notification too and um always hit the like button uh so that other so that it can fit in the uh youtube algorithm and other people can um see how great our community is as well uh you guys are truly have been a blessing to me i look forward to all of you guys i always i already feel like i know a bunch of you a bunch of you that I always see in the um, comments, but honestly, a lot of times I look at your names, uh, your your um, your YouTube name or your uh, address or whatever in there. Like Eddie is one of them that I know for sure. It's a few other that, others that I know too. I'm on the spot; I can't remember right offhand, but I know you guys based on that. And I like to know you guys, and um, just going forward, uh, I. Like anything, I feel like you need a community of like-minded people to succeed in anything in life. Anything in life. You need like-minded people. And you have to be able to keep the negativity at arm's length, at a, at a distance. Uh, and I like this community. I really like where we are where we are with things i like a lot of you guys experience a lot of the tokens you guys talk about you guys have some um really good perspectives on things and i figured what better way than to go off into the weekend learning a little bit more about you guys and uh all of you out there when i say you guys i don't mean you guys i mean you guys and girls out there because I see it is a lot, a lot of uh, uh, crypto females also in the uh, space. And I like to see that as well. Um, I love it. I love it. You guys, this crypto is not for the faint of heart. Not one bit. It is not for the faint of heart. It is a roller coaster ride. It is a roller coaster ride. And I, I, and I know this from the last time I went through it. I, above all else, know that. It is such a a mind rush of a roller coaster ride that sometimes we get so caught up in what's going on right now that we tend to forget that this is not going to last. That altcoin season is coming and all of this, this uh, fear, uncertainty, and doubt that some of you may have is going to go away and you're going to forget all about these times. And the only thing I ask, you know, is the saying that you should smell the roses along the way and enjoy yourself along the ride. Well, I'm going to use that as far as when it comes to this crypto journey, because in this crypto journey, I say you also need to experience everything that you're experiencing right now because this next the next cycle that we have when all of this is it dies down and we go into the bear market and then we go off into this next cycle when we go off into that next cycle all of you guys right now that that are experiencing the fear the uncertainty and the doubt you're going to be vets you're going to be vets at this you're going to be buying crypto next uh three years from now you're going to be buying a even through the bear market, you're going to be buying crypto and people are going to be, you're going to see people that are thinking like you may be thinking right now coming into crypto for their first time. And they're going to be saying to themselves, I don't know if I can deal with it. You're going to be like, no, 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 trust me, trust me, trust me. It's, it's worth it. There's sunshine on the other side of this. There is a pot at the end of the rainbow. And then we're going to get on, what are you going to buy? What do you plan to buy? And I don't know if that's personal to a lot of you guys, but I would love to know what are you guys going to buy? Are you going to buy a new car? Are you going to buy a new house, property? What are you going to buy? But most important, what are you going to do with your earnings that's going to 
put you in a space where you don't have to worry about things like you may be worrying about right now. Do you have a plan? I'm big on that. If you'd asked me that like decades ago, you know, what's your plan? What's your plan? I'm like, I don't know. I barely even think past next week. <laughs> but, but it's so important that, and I, and I say this, it's so important that when you're going to have the lump sum of money coming in, depending on what your investment was, but regardless what your investment is, you're going to get more money than you started with. You need a plan, else you're going to end up right back in the same. Some of you, you may want to leave your job. Some of you just uh, may want to just have a part-time job stop, and so you can enjoy life and do things on the side. Maybe start a, a business, travel more, see your family, uh, put smiles on their faces with uh, trips or whatever you want to do. I don't know. Everybody's different. Pay off some bills or whatever so you can get some breathing room. But as long as you have some type of plan, some type of plan, that's what I work on now. Just planning, planning, planning. I want to retire the rest of my family. That's one of my goals. I'm retired. Um, so I want to, that's my goal is to retire everybody else. That's one of my long-term goals, full transparency. And, uh, have no one worry about anything especially when it because finances can really can really ruin life it can ruin the beauty in life and it's sad it's like that uh but i don't want any of you guys to to get this large windfall that you're going to get again depending on what you invested and just blow it because it, there will be another cycle. There will be another cycle. But now is the time to plan. Do you plan on going out and buying a house? A Lambo? You know? What do you plan on doing? So, you guys, let me know down in the comments of that, too. And also, let me know how long you've been in crypto. What is your crypto uh, knowledge base? And um, I would love to hear from you guys as far as what type of videos you would like to see. Uh, coming forward and what kind of things you'd like to see again um, this is a community this is a community and I like it and I've been looking at you people I've been watching you I've been reading comments and I've been watching and I know the ones that are serious and I know it's a lot of you guys out there that don't say anything you just uh, watch the videos I thank you too. I just ask if you can come out the shadows for this one video and just let me know or well, you know what brings you to crypto what do you uh, like about the channel and the community and uh we can go from there this is all about dreams y'all this is about dreams you know i've been preparing for this for like over two years now and uh i can't believe that it's so close i can't believe we're really close when we head off into this uh fourth quarter and everything and uh, one more thing before i go i want you guys also and this is something you really have to pay attention to when it comes to your uh portfolio I don't know how many different tokens some of you hold. I probably hold like, and I know this is bad. I probably hold like 30 tokens. <clears throat> uh, a lot of them, I'm probably bullish on all of the tokens, but not so um, into all of the tokens I hold. I will say this though. Um, you have to know this. Is when it's time, when all coins season starts and your tokens start to rise don't expect your entire portfolio to rise at one time it doesn't work like that it doesn't work like that and i'm gonna use casper just as a great example casper for instance casper might uh take off casper might take off and you may be looking at a dollar two dollar casper and then you're looking back at your uh portfolio it was like what, what happened to h bar what happened to aerodrome what happened to velodrome what happened to all these different tokens that I have? What happened to them? Why aren't they um, moving up? Well, they work in cycles. And that's why it's important to not just be sleeping thinking, yeah, when I wake up 
in altcoin season, everything is just going to be up. It's not going to be like that. And if you expect that, you're going to miss out on a lot of games. You're going to miss out on a lot of the things that you saw when this video started. The guys were counting all the money or the Lambo or the, the mansions and the just, you know, just the fun things. The helicopter, if you want one. <laughs> uh, so you have to know. That's why I say no have an idea of what your coin could do each and every coin that you hold in your portfolio have an idea of how much that coin could rise so that you don't miss the boat thinking because this is be real if casper hit a dollar or two dollars uh before our coin season which would be great i wouldn't suggest you sit back and say yeah yeah i'm just i'm just gonna wait I'm wait for all coin season because yeah, this is just this is nothing. Wait till all coin season. No, no, you take your money, you take your money, and then on to the next coin. Each coin, they may have a cycle of when they the RWAs, the real world asset tokens. They may have a cycle when it's time for them to go up. So, and all of these cycles are on their way. They're coming. I just want to know what you guys are gonna do with it. What are your plans? What are your goals? What are your dreams? Get it as personal as you want. You know, this is a this is a free space. Or you can just be general. You can generalize it or whatever. Anyway, yeah. Let's talk. Let's get to know each other. All right, guys. I'm I'm really itching to read this. All right. See you. Peace.